It is annoying, but I can live with it. He's talking about wearing masks again at the gym. Starting today, masks are back in all public indoor spaces in Oregon. It's all part of the governor's announcement this week as COVID-19 cases and hospitalizations rise across the state. The new mandate requires everyone age five years of age and up, vaccinated or not, to wear masks in public indoor spaces. On public transportation, face coverings are required for passengers two years of age and older. Local businesses are adapting to the new changes today. And this morning, I visited the 24-hour fitness in downtown Portland, where one gym member we spoke with said he was happy about the change. I think it was really nice to be without a mask for a while and just like feel kind of uh, free and able to breathe. But ultimately, I think this is like with cases going up, with people getting sick, like I just know some people of mine who are in my circle who have uh, been exposed and it's been scary. So I think this is all to just to protect one another. And I think it's really important that we do that. As he said, a lot of people are used to being without a mask right now. So I asked the gym's manager if they have some tips for working out with your masks on again. From the feedback of our members and personal experience that the metal gr medical grade masks are easier to breathe in. And really it just comes down to listening to your body. Don't overexert yourself, especially with the mask coming back on after several months of them not being on at all. And so you have to get used to breathing differently with that face covering. She says mask wearing is really the only change people will see at their gym right now. As for the governor's announcement, she is also requiring all state employees to be fully vaccinated by October 18th or six weeks after the COVID-19 vaccine gets full FDA approval, whichever date is later. Those with certain disabilities or religious beliefs may qualify for exemptions.